So for people that may not know Art First, Art First Miami is an online art journalism medium, really, that came about because, unfortunately, uh, the Miami Herald began uh, doing less and less journalism about the arts. So um, Art, Art First does critical reviews for it started off with dance and the musical reviews and I think film. And it has expanded to do visual arts as well. Um, it's free, it is unbiased, it's independent journalism. The writers that we use are critically acclaimed, uh, amazing writers that work, that still work for um, the Miami Herald, well not the Miami Herald anymore, the Miami Herald picks up reviews from Art First um, because they don't pay writers anymore, unfortunately. It's, it's just, it's really difficult to get reviews for work that artists create now. So the county supports Art First Miami, who is completely funded by the county. Um, there's an amazing editor, Melina DeRose does a fantastic job of doing the editing for it. It's all independent. It's just an amazing source for what's happening now in the arts in Miami-Dade County. And then when COVID hit, we thought, oh my God, what are we gonna write about? The arts community did a fantastic job of you know, shifting and creating virtual events. And so we still had things to write about. So you can still go online to artbursmiami.com and find out what's happening. And now as things begin to open again, um, things are beginning to open again, whatever's happening in Miami Day, and it is Miami Day based, it's only about Miami Day. Whatever's happening in Miami Day, um, there's a diverse group of writers. There's a, we're getting close to 30 arts journalists now and it is a diverse group we are really pushing that to make sure we cover all neighborhoods all the all diversities um we have we have such an amazing group of writers and anyway, it's just been an amazing uh, amazing experience i've been working with i guess about two years now and it's been online for maybe three or four years if you haven't, for any viewers that haven't gone online to check it out, go check it out. If you want to know what's happening, or if you want to know what's good, if you're thinking about looking at a film or a performance or an opera or a ballet or an exhibition, I mean, everything that's happening in the county, it has probably been reviewed either before or after the event. So it's a great opportunity to find out what's going on and to support the arts in it. Um.